This video is about the premium Chia WordPress theme by Anarial Design. It is promoted as a theme for restaurants, cafes, delis and food blogs. It was created to be used with a WordPress blog editor. If this video will convince you to buy the Chia theme, please consider using my affiliate link. It helps me continue making videos like this one. As always, let's start by installing Chia on a fresh WordPress website without any content. First, you'll have to purchase the theme and download it to your hard drive. Then go to your dashboard, open the themes page, click on Add New and then Upload Theme. Select the zip file with the theme, install it and then click Activate. This is what an empty website looks like when Chia is activated. I will install and activate only two of the four recommended plugins, one-click demo import and recipe card blocks by WP Zoom. You should install just the plugins that you really need. If you don't sell anything or you use a different contact form plugin, don't install WooCommerce and WP Forms. Let's import the demo content. We are reminded about the recommended plugins. Let's skip them again. The import process can take a few minutes. You will see these warning messages if you skipped the installation of WooCommerce. Don't worry about them, that is perfectly normal. The demo content was imported with everything in it, including menus and widgets. Now let's go through the theme's options and settings. Open the customize page. In the Site Identity panel, you can upload your logo. You can display the site title and tagline with or without the logo. In the Theme Options panel, you can make many adjustments to the design and layout of your website. For example, the header has three different layouts with the option of making it sticky on scroll. In the Blog Options panel, you can change the appearance of blog archives and single posts. Yo. You can hide post meta, which is the published date and the category of a post. I think it would be better to have a separate checkbox for each snippet of data. The offer bio is displayed only if the offer has some text in their bio, otherwise it's always hidden. There are options for the copyright text, the skip to top button in the footer, the top info bar in the header, and the not found page. By default, it has this image. You can change it to something else. For regular pages, you can show or hide page titles. You may want to do that if you build your pages with a block editor and want to have a different style of page titles. In the colors panel, you can change only the background color. In a minute, I will explain why. Now let's get to the really interesting part, the block editor. I'll create a new empty page. If I add just a title and save a page, it will be empty. That's because my page titles were hidden in the customizer. I can build the structure of my page block by block. For example, an h1 heading tag and some paragraphs of text. The color and size of paragraphs and headings can be changed directly in the block settings panel. Here's another cool feature. Click on the plus sign and switch to the Patterns tab. 
In the Chia blocks category, there are 22 different block patterns. I can add the cover section instead of my standard page title. You can use any combination of standard WordPress blocks and custom block patterns to create unique pages. If you want to use the homepage layout as an example, you can import it from the Chia templates category, then simply replace your photos, texts and links. Of course, you can change the order of every block or remove the blocks that you don't need. If you have a food blog with recipes, the theme works well with a recipe card blocks plugin by WP Zoom. It provides an easy way to create beautiful and intuitive recipe blocks. It is a free plugin, but it also has a paid upgrade. Chia works well with a popular WooCommerce plugin. This is what your shop could look like with very little effort. Chia was released on 21st of April 2021. I'm making this video using the very first version of the theme. I expect it to get many updates in the future, with more layout options, block patterns and full page templates. Let me know what you think about the Chia theme in the comment section below. If this video convinced you to buy the Chia theme, please consider using my affiliate link. It helps me continue making videos like this one. On this channel, I make videos about WordPress, search engine optimization, online marketing and a few other topics. If you need professional help in creating or managing your website, please get in touch. You can support my work by subscribing to my channel, liking this video and leaving a comment below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.